Hello, I'm Radioactive Duck, and this is Dwarf Fortress. We are going to continue our active game in the Oracular Plains in our Fortress of Tax Cudgel. So, last time we had, uh, I had just come back from a bit of a break, and so we kind of went over everything again. We sent out some squads, and we'll see how that, that progresses. We'll see if they come back or not, so... We're going to get things started right off the bat. Um, I'm going to check and see if our squads have actually left. Routine. Um, we may have to turn off their training. I don't remember if we have to turn off their training. Um, we're just going to do no orders for them right now. That way they're free to go. Um... I don't remember if we have to do that or not, but I was also going to look into whether or not we could just do, um, I install a switch <laughs> and have our dwarves train on that, but I did not look into that, so I have no idea, um, how to do that yet. I mean, obviously we can put switches somewhere, but, all right, we're gonna lamb merchants, okay. We're gonna continue to build our fortress upwards. I do want to check out, though, what's going on down here. Because I know that we had a couple, um, a couple issues with some, some monsters lurking. Um, nobody's down, we haven't gotten down to that level yet. Um, let's see. Do we have any monsters? I thought... One of them got, like, trapped in here and drowned. I can't remember. This is a very... I think this might be it. Oh. Maybe. Anna Strike Curse's Forgotten Beast Decor. Yeah, I think this is the, the beast that died. And I think that's a person who died as well. Um, this is a very, like, precarious um, situation here with, with the water and stuff. <laughs> so I know that we wanted to flood this area to you know, get water down here to, to get rid of some of the uh, magma that popped in there, but still. Um, let's see what's going on down here. I think we still have the making, yeah, making cages. Um, why do we have so many lead cages? Why were we making so many of these? I don't remember. Um... Well, whatever. Oh, it's because of the owl bear that attacked and killed a bunch of people, and so I wanted to set up some traps up top. That's what it was. I remember now. Well, let's uh, continue to, you know, get some work done. So we still have a good amount of food and drink. Um, I could turn down production on that. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ah, uh, rotten kangaroo meat. Okay. Well, is it just the rotten kangaroo meat or is there something else? Claystone gizzard stones. I don't know what. How do these things. How how do we get these weird gizzard stones? Like, do the am are the animals like eating weird shit? I don't know. Um, I'll have to look into that as well because I know we have a couple of them, and some of them are like kind of valuable. So I don't know. Okay, we need all of this crap to be put away. There's a lot of food here. It needs to be put away before it spoils. <laughs> We are in mid-autumn. Okay, so I don't think we're going to have any more traders until the spring, which is good. Oops. Um, let's continue to... What is, is this? the rotten stuff? Yeah. 
let us continue. Oh, and we also set up traps uh, to, to deal with like the goblin forces that invade from time to time. Um, okay, let's continue laying down floor tile up here. We were doing that little by little. Um, because we're going to build upwards. So we're just going to finish the floor tile. And then we'll start working on the walls. So floor. We're going to do here to here. And we're doing granite. Okay. Okay. I was going to put a staircase here too, wasn't I? Um, I don't want to quite do that yet until we have all the walls up. Because that would make it really easy for things to get inside the fortress. And I don't quite want to do that yet. But... We can start putting walls up over here. Um, we can do that. So let's let's do. We're gonna do some walls right here. If you hear anything, it is my cat playing with one of his toys. I just heard him moving some stuff around. All right, we're gonna do granite. And then what about down here? Let's do this area here. Granite. All right, that looks good. I should have let them finish putting all this food away. I'm dumb. <laughs> it's not so bad, but still. Um, we will, um, I'll hold off. I'll hold off. Let them finish all this stuff before we do anything else. I am kind of curious to see, I think it's too soon to gauge how our squads are doing. I also don't remember where I sent them. Um, missions. Raise Twinkled Scorpions. What is this? No commanders, no commanders. Um, this mission cannot be altered now. Yeah, that's fine. Where is Twinkled Scorpions? That is Torment Image. I think this is Twinkled Scorpions. Okay. Um, how are the missions going? Doesn't... I don't think anybody's there yet. Yeah, it's too, it's too soon to gauge. My cat is sitting here staring at me. What a weirdo. All right. Move quicker, go faster. I think the blocks that we're using are very far away, so that could also be what's taking additional time. And I see the floor tile is still shifting. I don't know why.
Why is he so unhappy? I should check and see why certain people are unhappy and try to fix that. We'll do that after they lay down the floor tile and put all the food away. Actually, we could do that now <laughs> because it won't stop them from working. All right. Um, scholar, he's upset and he's upset. Well, let's find out why. Squad. Oh, he needs to acquire some objects. He is dejected to be wearing old clothing. Okay, here's the thing. I have tons of clothing everywhere. There's tons and tons of clothing. We have an excess of clothing. So if you want to go acquire an object, go acquire an object. Like, you're the one who's working too hard. I don't know how to, like, send him to go do that. Um... Anyways, let's go check out the other person. <laughs> All right. Do, 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 do. Animal dissector. He's laying down floor tile, I think. Oh, there's my cat. Okay. He needs to craft an object and be with friends. Annoyed when caught in the rain. Is relieved being near a waterfall. Lonely after being away from friends. Okay, so he just needs to, to take some time off. So when we're done laying all this floor tile and putting these walls up, I'm going to give everybody a time just to hang out and get some stuff. Go get some objects if they want. Um, ooh, he's a competent gem cutter, adequate wax worker, dabbling animal trainer. Interesting. Seems pretty talented. Anyways, let's see how we're coming along. All right, that wall is almost done. People are throwing their clothes off in the middle of the snow. Ah, uh, another cat has adopted somebody. That's nice. We like that. Um, therapist is sparring. They're sparring. That's fine. That's fine. A ban on certain exports. Well, let's find out yeah we can't make a steel slab so yeah the outpost liaison is just gonna have to deal with it export of figurines prohibited export of picks prohibited export of amulets prohibited that's fine we need to make some goblets um but i have those set to auto make so that should get taken care of in its own time All right, floor has been floored. Rest of the walls are going up. All right, that's looking good. Ooh, interesting. Musk melon. All right. Oh, somebody's chopping down. I've got trees set to be chopped down? I guess I do. Or do I have the auto-chop function set? I don't remember. That could also be. Alright, walls are done. Well, those walls are done anyways. Um, let us let everybody... We'll, we'll give everybody some time to, to just hang out. I would also like them to put all this shit away. <gasps> Almond wood crutch. Huh. Well, let's see. Let's follow the person who is upset. We're going to follow this guy around. See what he does. So he has no job right now, and yet he's still upset. So he's going to go drink. He's going to dance. He's going to drink. Um, and this, this is the guy that needed stuff. Like he felt bad for being in rags. So he's listening to poetry. Will he go get some new clothes? I don't know. He's going to listen to poetry 
And that's all he's going to do, apparently. All right, now he's going to go make a scroll. What if I canceled that job for him? Like, what if I made him not a scholar? Um, what if we did that? All right, so he's going to go make a scroll. That's a pretty long way to walk, so maybe... Oh, no, that, that, there's, okay. We have multiple libraries. I forgot about that. There's a library up there. There's a library down here. Um, so he's probably assigned to one of the libraries down here, but I guess we'll find out. All right, so he's gonna make a scroll. There he goes. He seems quite upset to do it. <laughs> um... Looks like the other person who was unhappy maybe isn't. All right, he's going to go pick up some equipment. Good. Yeah, go get some new gear. My God. All right, where is he going? He is going to go get some equipment. That's great. Get provisions. Okay. Store item in bin, that's fine. All right, no job. So he's just gonna hang out? Like, what's he gonna do? Store owned item. So is he gonna go to his room? He is, and his room is up here. Okay, so maybe we should assign him to the library up here, if he's not. Um, I don't know. All right, now he's gonna socialize. That's great. How is he, how is his mood? How is he feeling? He is Content after putting on a well-crafted item. Content after putting on a superior item. Satisfied at work. Blissful remembering a soapy bath. That's great. There you go. So I'm wondering. Satisfied discussing problems with an acquaintance. So his life seems pretty good, eh? And yet he is still the most unhappy person. All right, so our animal dissector is listening to poetry. Our scribe, who's also unhappy, is praying. Our human lasher is socializing. He's also unhappy. Um, okay. Well, let's continue um, following this, this guy around, I guess. All right, so he's socializing, and that made him even more unhappy, apparently. And now he's going to go make some crafts somewhere. He's going to the furthest craft station. <laughs> he's going to the one that's furthest away. Why? There are so many craft stations that are closer to everything else. This craft station is down here, like close to the bottom. Wait, where is he going? Oh, he's getting, oh, he's getting rocks. That's what he's doing. I'm like, why is he going so far? But we need a, okay. So that's a, a long way to go for rocks. And the thing is, nobody's moving them up to the, to, the, to, to the designated rock storage zone. So I may need to give them time to do that. We'll see. We'll see. I was going to say, our rock crafting stations are, are here. There are some ones that are closer down to the magma, but they're only set up to do, like stuff that we need down there, you know? So, um, 
I wonder. I'm not going to follow him for a moment. I would like to, I guess, create another storage for rocks, maybe, that's a little bit closer down there. Um, this would be a good spot for rock storage, I guess. I don't know if anybody will move things to it, but this is a much closer distance to walk than all the way down to the magma. Like, I would hate having to do that, so. All right, and it's just gonna be rocks, but it's gonna be just um, all of the other stone. All right, I think that'll do. Hopefully we'll have citizens move things in there. Let's go back and um, follow him around again. So he's socializing yet again. I mean, I feel like he has a pretty good life. He just got some finely crafted goods. Um, you know, he doesn't have a crazy boss like screaming at him all day. He's able to go and do whatever he wants, whenever he wants. What does he have to be unhappy about? Satisfied discussing, discussing problems with an acquaintance. Feels pleasure near a very fine paved road. Okay. He's satisfied upon improving stone crafting. He's satisfied at work. And he was able to put on some more items. So he's acquired like five things and he still has this unmet need of acquiring an object. <sighs> oh, he's depression prone. Okay, so I think maybe he's just... Oh, he's sunk into depression. I think maybe he's just depressed. Like, I have a feeling that there are just going to be dwarves that we can't really do anything with. Um... Ah, trauma in 119. I don't remember what that was. Probably uh, like a goblin attack. Yeah. After a long patrol duty in 818, he is quite ambitious. He can sometimes act without deliberation. He enjoys the company of others. Okay. He needs alcohol to get through the working day. That could be said of all of the dwarves. It really could. Well... Griffin chicks have hatched. That's great. Um, let's see if we can check on our squads. See how the mission is going. Wait, did they come back? Wait. They did come back. No civilized population is there. All right. Well, that's pretty amazing. Let's... Um, Let's, so they came back, that was, that was quick. Let's send another mission to, to conquer that. Um, hang on a second. Squads. This squad. Um, can we actually send a squad there? I don't know. I should actually, um, Okay. Release of the prisoners, loot, steal livestock, take important treasure. Oh, there's just nobody there. Okay, well, if that's the case, um, no, we're not going to do anything with them. All right, hang on. We're going to send another troop out. We're going to send, we're going to do another mission. Um, let's take out, let's take out these and we're gonna raise it's gonna be these three yet again all right the war the war rages on all right i feel like now is a good time to take a break i'll catch you in the next one and so adios